So my favorite thing to get is the hand-drawn logos that people want to be able to engrave at a really small size. And when you zoom in on it after you've scanned it in, you're like, yeah, it's a beautiful drawing, but how am I going to clean this up so I can actually see some of the details? And it's not just going to engrave one big blob or look really weird. So how I approach this, the first thing I'm going to do is trace my image. I am going to make a couple of quick adjustments just to get a little more white space in here. Hit OK. I always leave my original image just in case I need to redo this. A lot of times I'll actually make a copy of it, but I'll throw it over here so I don't mess with it. And now I've got what will engrave. So this for me, my blue is my engrave. Red just kind of shows me if I were cutting it out or my outlines. I'm going to leave it blue so I can <clears throat> see exactly what's going to engrave out. Still way too many fragments or uh, artifacts in here. So I'm going to show you guys my favorite tool. I'm going to come in here and I'm going to grab this guy. So I'm going to ungroup everything. And then I'm going to grab a hold of this line right here. It's a pretty decent size. Anything over that size should engrave fairly well. So I'm going to grab that. I'm going to go up to my edit and I'm going to click on select small shapes or select shapes smaller than selected. Again, what I love about Lightburn, it does what it says. It says what it does. So it is going to select shapes smaller than the one I've selected. So I'm going to click that and then I'm just going to pull these artifacts out of here. I did lose the eyes, which I can go in and fix, but you can see already how much cleaner this logo is with just one little step. So from here I can go in and now I can fix the eyes. I can do a little bit of node adjustments in the face just to clean up some of this jagged stuff and I'll have a much cleaner looking engraving of this logo when I am done. And I can just kind of go over here and delete this stuff. So I hope that was helpful to you guys. Again, it is the select shapes smaller than selected tool. And if you'd like to know more, I do run Lightburn boot camps. You can find those at joneslasercraft.com. Thanks so much. And I'll talk with you all again soon. Mm -hmm.